Alright, so we're just back in the JF-17 uh, very quickly. I just want to show off one of the new features that came in the last Open Beta update. And that is, if I jump in the cockpit, canopy fogging. Uh, currently I'm about 40,000 uh, feet and put it down to zero degrees outside just to show it off. But if you look down the front there, you can see all the fogging on the canopy. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the first plane to actually implement this. And this is only the first attempt by Deke Orion Works, so they will be working on it. But I think that is very cool. Now, I don't think it's on the external model. Well, it's very hard to see anyway, but uh, yeah, I wouldn't expect it to be on there, but. Uh, yeah, now down here, uh, if I turn some console lighting on, you'll see a defog switch. If I hit that, the little fan starts up. And I can make it more toasty inside, put the temperature up. And you'll see all this fogging start to clear. There you go. Now some people might think that is uh, not that important feature compared to the rest of the systems, but as far as I'm concerned, it's those little uh, those little details, those small immersive things uh, that really set a module apart. And Deco Ironworks is, as far as I'm concerned, leading the way in regards to all those uh, types of things. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to quickly show up that uh, defog system, I do believe, uh, just turns itself off after a while. Um, yeah, I know the F-18 and other planes have the uh, levers and the dials for them that uh, you can manipulate, but and uh, I usually just do that uh, using my own um, immersion when it's a cold weather outside or whatever, but uh, to actually see it implemented. Uh, I think it's terrific and I just wanted to show that off. So, yeah, once again, this JF-17 is surprising me. Um, Deke Ironworks really are showing themselves to be a terrific developer.